What's up, y'all? It's your boy Carcino here. See, I see the issue that uh, a lot of people have with the sport of boxing. Everybody's saying, oh, it's going to make a turn and get better. No, it isn't. Because it's the same old BS happening all over again. I mean, we always seeing the guy that wins the fight don't get his hand raised. That's the problem. We need to get that fixed. You know, it's the corruption with the officials. Nothing's changed. It's the same way it's been since the beginning of time. And they're not going to change it because they're getting money. They're not going to reward the guy with no backing who just comes in, wins the fight. They're still going to rob him. Because who cares in the end? You're going to forget about it in two weeks. That's their philosophy. So why should they change it? You'll be outraged, but you'll forget about it in two weeks. And then nothing happens. And everybody forgets that fight and it's business as usual. That's the problem. That is the problem. And unless... Now you're going to say, well, how do we fix the problem? Here's the, the way you fix the problem. Stop supporting it. If they won't give you fair fights and fair decisions, I'm not going to another fight. I'm not going to watch that fight. That's how you put it in this stuff like that. <laughs> okay? You won't be seeing, I'm not saying this is the most outrageous decision in boxing history. This is just the one that just really just say, you know, forget this year. Already. You know what I'm saying? We got the Chavez uh, Jr. thing that went on earlier last year. We just saw that happen it's with Vera. So it's like, and here we are. This, this year just started right off, and here comes another one. Another one. So we can't, we got to get it right. You know, boxing got to get right. If the guy wins, I don't care if Al Heyman ain't the guy that's backing him or his promotional company or there's no money in him if he won the fight he won the fight people just gotta take a loss that's just it if you lose you lose that's it come back stronger y'all say losses don't matter then give them what they took I mean they took an L um, Herrera, Herrera should be holding up the belts his family would have loved to seen him as world champion they, they saw that he won the fight but he got no belts and he got a loss, a L for it. You know, where's the justice? So, this is why boxing is going to be the one that's in the back rooms and not on the big networks. Imagine something like that happening on NBC or ABC right now. It'll be an outrage. But they're going to keep replaying it over and over again? Come on. We need to, we're better than this. The sport can be so much better, so much talent out there that let the best man win. You don't have to pacify us with a one fighter and make him all out and give us the airbrush and the, and the songs and the R&B rappers and the gold chain. We don't need all that. We don't really need that. Just tell, get the fighters, the best fighters, put them in the ring, whoever wins, that's who won. You know, honor and, and give merit to those who earn it. I believe in the merit system. And so far, people ain't building up points and they getting rewarded for doing nothing. And a lot of this is the people's fault. Y'all crown people in two fights. You know, they the killer and they you just repeat the hype. And stop telling me Danny Garcia's power punch stats. Don't you realize they pull that stat up just to try to justify Danny Garcia? Like, oh, look look how many power punches he landed. You don't know how many per round he landed over the other guy, and then is that going to determine the fight? What they determine is a power punch? As I'm scoring the rounds, okay, as in a total. And whoever wins the most rounds wins the fight if it goes to the cards. Those are the rules. It don't say nothing about power punches in the rule book. So, I'm out. I just wanted to share my piece on the state of where we are right now. Everyone thinks, like, we're getting better. We're not getting better. People just getting rich. That's just it.